Hey guys, it's Brenda with Pete's RV Center, Sherrillville, Indiana, and I've got a client request for this 2015 Coachman Freelander 29KS. Let's get started. So up front, it's on the Chevy chassis, the 4500, and I got most of the storage open, but I think I forgot a couple here. Let's check them out. This is just going to be your propane down here. That comes filled when you purchase the camper. They service the batteries. They full, do a full PDI safety inspection, some cleaning, wash the awning. We spot seal the roof. That one's locked. We'll check that out later with some pictures for the client. Got a little latch here for the door and a screen door. Screen looks good on it. Don't see any tears. I'm gonna back it up for a second here. So that is a full power awning up there. It goes almost the whole length of the coach there. And that'll create a nice space outside for you to put an outdoor rug, your picnic table. I like cooking outside so I'd set up my cooking stuff. Sometimes I just put my coffee maker right outside. So that's uh, back your hot water heater. We've got some outlets here. Your exhaust for your furnace. In the back of the fridge, there's an entertainment area out here, which is really cool. This TV swings out on the arm and you can have some fun outside under your awning. Now the storage on the back of this one is really good. You've got this area here and that has a shelf in it that goes deeper. So that's really cool. I'm gonna zoom on this tire real quick so you can see. It's got the double tires back here. Okay, and now the back storage is awesome. You can access it from three different doors. The side door, the rear door, and then the other side door for the pass-through. So you've got little dips in there to organize, which I love to do. And then, I mean, you could get a ton of stuff back here. All these will lock. You can lock them up when you're driving. Here's the back view. And we're gonna go down here. So it looks like you can tow 5,000 pounds on this one. Here's your seven pin on the left. I'm gonna back up so you can see the back of it here. We've got a ladder on the back and your backup camera. got a dark tint on the windows. I do have, for anyone that's watching, a 2019 Freelander too. Do a video on that one a different day. But they're both really nice. And the ones that I've seen come in just hold up very well. And then of course we still do the prep on them for any issues that need to be taken care of. So it does have this one. I feel like somebody got, um, something stuck on that when they were pulling something out of here and it damaged it but I don't think it's anything more than cosmetic that's the back storage there we'll get a view of this side here for you so you can see slide topper nice dark tint on the windows there and a pretty design your water hookups it's like a flush here for your black tank and that looks like your power cord storage there more storage lots and lots of storage on this one 
and then I did not unlock. Oh, I did unlock that one. Let's see. Oh, more storage. <laughs> and then here's your generator. We do service the generator on motorhomes too with the prep. So own on 4,000 in this one. All right. Let's go inside. It's the front cab. It looks like this was the 50th anniversary. Pretty cool, 2015. Could get that off with some goo gone. All right, so handle going in, two steps. Battery. Here's all the entryway here, your fuse box, battery disconnect. Bring the awning in and out. These will be some lights here. Oh, that's actually the outside light. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, it's hard to see in the daytime, but if you guys come in, I'll show you. Let's go in. Ooh, floor is pretty. I have actually not been in this one yet, so we're looking at it for the first time together, too. So I'll kind of pan so you can see everything. That looks comfortable. All right, I'll give you a view of the front here. Oh, that's what I like to see. A nice wide opening, get in and out of there. I hate when they're tight. If you're interested in getting a motorhome from Pete's, you can always feel free to call Pete's at 219-865-1656 and ask for me and we'll set up a test drive for you. Okay, up front. We've got windows on the left that open. This will flip over and you'll have a huge bed up there for your guests. Or if you sleep separate, you'll have a separate bed for you guys. Um, there's your ladder to get up here and that'll hook into that spot right here when that flips over. Looks like you got a TV and a swivel over there and a DVD CD player. Nice big storage up here. And that'll go all the way across. They velcroed their little remotes there. So that's really cool. Another big window that opens up front. This will go down to a bed too. I'm noticing a little wear on some of these, but I've seen I've seen way worse. So you'll have two seatbelts. <clears throat> excuse me, over here. And I'll have to see if there's seatbelts under there, but that does lift up there. Okay. Yep. There's seatbelts under there and storage too. They sell a lot of cute covers for this stuff. I've seen so many people DIY and like renovate their campers oh my gosh you can do so much now paint the cabinets or I, I actually really like these cabinets so i don't know if i'd do that but the seat covers would look really cute you could kind of make it your own so that'll flip down to a little futon style bed this is nice and cushy here and let me just see yep you can bring a lot of people with you looks like six seat belts in the back here so that's awesome Here's your kitchen, oven, cooktop, double sink, needs a little cleaning, microwave, and storage. We've got a flip up here to give you more storage space. Here's your entry cat closet. Up here too, some little hooks. And I'll just show you the ceiling here. We've got a vent and a vent up front. AC is ducted all through. 
And there's your air conditioner there. I might just need a new filter or cleaning. Okay, let's check it out. So propane electric fridge. It's working. And then here's your control board with everything. So we can go over that a little more when you come in or you can um, see if I can get the generator hours. I don't think it's going to show me without the coach on, but we can go over that when you come in or you can pause it here if you want to look at that further. This door is a sliding door that will come across to give you privacy in the bathroom. And then someone can get ready while the other person is showering or using the toilet. So here's your bathroom. That's a lot of space. I like the pass through because you get a little more room. See how the counter space there? Drawers to organize. And then under sink storage here. Some outlets. And your AC is ducted in here too. And let's peek in here. Okay, so you have a little leg room there. Good. Spot to hang your towels fan and your shower so that skylight will give you about six inches of headroom there sorry I'm trying to pan while talking multitasking you know then it looks like you've got storage for towels and TP over here or whatever you want to use it for that's what I use it for all right Last but not least, the bedroom. So that's a queen size bed. Got plenty of spots to put your clothes back here from above to the sides there. And even some drawers. Sometimes you don't get those drawers in the bedroom. So that's nice. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> yep. That's where that is. Okay, well, easy access if you need to do any maintenance. So you've got three big windows back here that'll open too for a nice breeze and another vent. I'll show you one of the closets over here and then the back side of the bedroom. But yeah, you'll have spot to hang here, spot to hang on the other side, drawers, nice ledge to put your water, your phone or whatever your book on. But yeah, it's a nice camper. Doesn't smell like anything, which is always a good sign. You can put a TV right there on the wall. And then there's a look at the balances. Or the shades, they look good. All right, well, I hope you've enjoyed our tour today. We're always taking in new campers and uh, for the shape this one is in, this one is at an excellent price, you guys. These are some of the best prices that I have seen um, all year. So if you're looking to get started, we carry travel trailers, fifth wheels, motorhomes, and all new and used, and all of our used and our new 22s and 23s are at liquidation pricing. So you can reach me at Pete's RV Center, 219-865-1656. Happy camping.